hi what's up everyone how's it going how have all of you been i know it's been a long time and i don't even know what i'm gonna call this video but i just felt like recording so here we are i'm enjoying my coffee what about you guys how's life been and please don't ask me why the christmas tree is still out <laughs> i've actually found an artificial plant that looks like the real deal i'm gonna uh, show you once it gets delivered and once I set it up. So ever since this year started, we all actually have resolutions, right? I made a few of mine. A few of them are still on track, thankfully. We're in March, mid-March, so that's great. Kudos. <laughs> There's a few that still need a check. One of the resolutions that still needs to be taken care of is that I need to not use my phone for at least an hour after I wake up. You know, the first thing we do after waking up is go on our phones, check for notifications, open the gram, scroll on TikTok, watch YouTube videos. And this is a bad habit. Having quiet mornings is an absolute goal and I'm hoping that by the end of the year it actually becomes a habit. Today was one of those mornings where I did not use my phone for at least an hour. It was probably over that. I mean it's only now that I'm using my phone to record this video. I woke up, I brushed my teeth, used the washroom, haha. <laughs> I worked out and then I showered and now I've just made myself some coffee and here I am talking to all of you. And we've been sitting here for quite some time now. I think we should head to the kitchen and make ourselves some breakfast. Let's go. Spring is almost here and it feels stunning honestly. The sun is shining so bright. It's a pleasant day, it's not too windy today. So the plan was to make breakfast, but I haven't gotten around to it yet. I'm just gonna reply to a quick email and then get to it. The email took a while. It was just one email, okay? But it took a while. And then Sue had also taken over the kitchen and now I'm gonna go and cook. What are we having? I am planning to have a low carb, no carb <laughs> breakfast. I'm gonna do uh, boiled eggs and pesto and maybe I will have it with some chili oil yum okay let's do it now boiling an egg doesn't take much I'm just gonna show you the pesto and the chili paste that I use it's this one sambal olek best chili paste ever absolutely love it and then I get this uh, basil pesto from Costco amazing pesto so I was boiling eggs and Sue comes in and he's like, I'll have some too. So you see three of his, three of mine. And I've already salted them. Now I'm just putting pepper. Yeah, trying to make it look pretty. <laughs> Failed attempt. Welcome to Vrindarevna Balak's YouTube. Here's where we taste and try boiled eggs. Like, what am I even doing? <laughs> this is honestly so random. But then again, this is what I do daily. I mean, yeah, I do keep on changing my breakfast every now and then. And yeah, let's be real, right? Not gonna lie, basic, but good. Brilliant, in fact. So we're done with coffee and breakfast. Eggs were filling enough for me because I think I just had them after coffee. Otherwise, I would occasionally add in like a bread or two slices, have them with butter, maybe do an avocado toast. But yeah, as I do more of these, I'm sure I'm going to share them with you. I'm just going to have my detox water. This is actually what I drink. I have about four of these uh, sippers in a day. One... One sipper has about 600 ml of water and... Uh, if I have four, obviously that means I do like 2.4 liters of water daily, which is great for my water intake. This one currently has um, lemon and mint in it. Tastes so refreshing. I do like a variation of these every day. Um, sometimes I put like strawberries, raspberries and blueberries in it. Sometimes I'll do strawberry and kiwi. On other days, I would do maybe watermelon. Sometimes it's lemon and mint, mint and cucumber. There's like amazing variations and makes drinking water <laughs> fun because otherwise you know people don't really want to drink a lot of water and this makes it a little exciting if you understand what i'm trying to say here so i was just talking to you guys obviously and this is what i noticed do you see it white hair man i just turned 28 and i'm not liking seeing white hair 
<laughs> but then again it's part of growing up right all of us have like one or two white hair anyways and uh, yeah so this is just me trying to accept who i am <laughs> so sue just made that chicken and i'm having that for lunch she had it for breakfast along with the boiled eggs and this is a red pepper sauce pasta that i made yesterday and uh, i obviously sort of like meal prepped so i'm having this again for lunch today detox water and my food is it really good i would definitely uh, share the recipes of these with you the next time i'm making them okay and so this is becoming eat with brinda in every corner of the house <laughs> it's time for a snack now and i'm having this peanut butter protein bar it's not sponsored it's just one of those protein bars that i really like these come in different flavors this is the peanut butter one su likes the chocolate one so he has um those not saying i don't like chocolate but i like this one a lot this is the peanut butter one i'll link it in the description if you want to have protein intake during the day in your meals is so important when you're wanting to lose weight and also at the same time gain muscle tastes really good i'm i'm genuinely telling you this tastes really good You know what this actually tastes like? A great alternative to Snickers bar. It's really yum. And now it's time for the last meal of the day, dinner. I'm going to have shirataki noodles with shrimp. And that ladies and gents is dinner. I just put a dollop of peanut butter there, this shrimp, peppers and shirataki noodles. at the dining table and here's food yeah did you know that shirataki noodles like a whole pack just has 30 calories in it it's actually made from tofu and is a really healthy option if you want to substitute your noodles that way you settle your craving and don't even gain the calories so dinner is done and now we're going to end the day with green tea this is the one i have uh raspberry pomegranate and strawberry green tea tastes phenomenal <laughs> smells even more delicious makes green tea a little less boring i'm going to wait for my green tea to get a little warm so that i can sip it and i'm going to end this vlog right here i really hope this was helpful to you i will make more such vlogs of whatever i'm eating during the day so you can follow along if that interests you Don't forget to like, share and subscribe to my channel. I will see you in my next video. Bye.